what's there is happen? an assumption of knowledge of the laws if you're going to be on the roads. Uh, and how in certain cases, people are notified. Ordinarily, how many laws are there? <laughs> I don't know, it's like asking how many lawyers are there, huh? But you, you don't know how many there are, so you can't know all of them, can you? Oh, you are quite correct with that. I don't know all of the laws uh, in the state of New Hampshire. Um, so how can every driver on the road know all of them? You are correct. You can't know all of the laws on the road, but there is an assumption that you do know the laws uh, pertaining to you know, operating motor vehicle safety. Regarding demerit points, the average citizen probably doesn't know that, but be that as it may. But ma'am, looking at your record, um, and the fact, as I said initially, if you had taken a demerit point reduction class, you wouldn't even be here today. Uh, it's unfortunate that when you called up to find out about your points that the demerit point reduction class wasn't forwarded to you, or you weren't made aware of that at the time. Did you have a chance to look at it? I'm going to find that um, you admitted to the convictions as listed on your motor vehicle record for calendar year 2007 based on the violation dates, which totaled 12. You're over 21. You're subject to a 90-day loss of license. You didn't dispute your motor vehicle record. Uh, respondent's license operating privilege is hereby suspended for 90 days, effective 12-1 a.m., January 20th, 2009. I'm going to hold the 90 days of the above-mentioned suspension in advance, and you're on probation for one year, conditional good behavior to mean no motor vehicle convictions. If the condition is violated, the remaining 90-day license suspension shall be imposed consecutively to any other suspension. You are required to complete a safe driver's course and provide proof of completion in the form of an original certificate within 45 days. If you fail to provide a certificate of completion of the safe driver's program within 45 days, all 90 days of the suspension will be imposed directly and without hearing. I've taken into consideration those things that you've represented regarding the laws in New Hampshire and uh, the rules of the road. So I think that an appropriate action in this is to give you the opportunity to go through a demerit point reduction class. It'll remove three points from your license. It'll be the three most recent ones that you were convicted of. As I said before at the beginning of the hearing, if you had taken this course prior to coming here today, well, you wouldn't even be here. Uh, so I'm going to order you to take a safe driver's course. What you need to do is that if you take that within 45 days and provide the original certificate, then you're going to be on probation for the next year with 90 days hanging over your head. If you don't get any other violations that result in a conviction, then it's going to go away. If you do get another conviction that results in a, uh, another violation that results in a conviction, then the 90 days loss of license may be imposed. What's going to happen is that you'll be asked to come back here for another hearing, a violation of probation hearing. Um, do you have anything that you'd like for me to consider, or any questions or anything I can answer for you, ma'am? Uh, no. Okay, what I've got here is a safety, sir, do you mind? I assume you have access to a computer? Mm -hmm. Okay, that is a website that has a list of the demerit point reduction classes on it. Uh, if you go to that and you sign up for it, I think it costs $50 and I think it takes an afternoon. Uh, if you go to that, I would take a look at it relatively quickly because they can fill up. Uh, there should be one in your area, isn't it? Out near that area, I'm sure that they offer a few of them out that way. If you go, um, they'll provide you with a certificate. Just make sure the DMV gets it, and the three points will be removed. Uh, where this happened in 2007, we're now in 2009. I don't think that it's likely that you're going to be in here for another demerit points based on another violation if you get one, unless it's a major violation. But uh, what's the, what do you call the status of that I'm in right now with uh, Well, according to the record that I have, it says you're not under suspension or revocation of this date. You've testified that you don't hold the license, though. So there's no suspension or revocation happening right now? Not happening right now. Not according to one, as of one twelve oh nine. 